Hi, I'm Gary and welcome to Jargon Free Help. Now many of you ask me, how do I get a DVD that maybe you've recorded off your TV onto a DVD recorder, or if you've got a film that you've purchased and you actually want to copy that onto something like this, your iPhone, your iPad, or maybe even onto your computer. Well, there's some great software to do that, but I must warn you that copying movies that you've purchased and putting them onto devices like these is in some places illegal, although there's a lot of talk about changing a lot of the rules around this so that people can use them for their own use. Clearly distributing it is illegal, that's piracy. Don't do that. But even in the UK, they're now looking into actually changing it that you are allowed to take it from here and use it for your own use on any other device. This hasn't completely been cleared up yet, so just be careful, a bit like copying music. But anyway, so what do I use to do this? Well, I use a program called Handbrake, and it's excellent. Now, on the website, if you look under video under my tutorials, or if you actually go to Jug and Free Tutorials on iTunes, I've actually got two tutorials there. One is using Handbrake for Windows, and the other one is using Handbrake for the Mac. And they're both very, very similarly used on both. They give excellent quality and they've got presets so you can actually choose whether you want it on an iPhone, iPad, iPod Touch, iPhone 4, Universal, so you can watch it on like maybe the computer and there's some other options as well. And on those tutorials, I actually cover those and they give you excellent quality in a good sized file that you can then watch on any of these devices. And I have to say, it's excellent. So. Check out the tutorials if you want to know more. It's Handbrake. If you want to download it, it's handbrake.fr, but you'll see more of that if you go to the tutorials themselves. Anyway, I've got a great app that I found this week and I'm gonna show it to you now. So let's take a look at this week's app of the week. Well, this week's app of the week is one called Penultimate. I saw someone else using it and I checked it out. I think I paid £1.19 for it, which isn't too bad, but basically what it allows me to do is to write on it, and I'm using my finger for it, and it's actually, as you can see, quite easy to use. Now, the chap that I saw using it was using a stylus, like a pen for writing on here, and he got it, it's the Wacom Bamboo Stylus. I think I looked it up and it was about £25, but check out the country that you're in and you might find obviously different prices. But as you can see, it's really useful, you can draw on it as well, so absolutely fantastic. I really like this. I've been using it for taking notes in meetings and when I was on a training session the other day. So that's excellent. It's called Penultimate for iPad. It's for the iPad, iPad 1 and iPad 2. So go and check that out. So that's a really useful app. And I've got more of those coming. Sorry, I haven't done the app of the week now for some weeks, but I'm going to be looking around at some excellent apps that are actually out there. A lot of people do tell me excellent apps that they use and then they drop me a line telling me about them and then I can feature them on here so we get to share it with everyone. Apps generally are either free or very cheap, so they're really good value for a lot of these things. Anyway, that's it for this week. Don't forget to go and check out the tutorials on Handbrake. If you look under the video section, I'll put them on the iTunes section as well. And also don't forget you can go and check them out on iTunes looking up jargon free tutorials. And then you can download them onto your devices and watch them there as well. Thanks for watching. Don't forget jargon free help is more than just technology.